my uh, Christian experience, my journey, I think it's, um, first of all, I'd like to say uh, good role models are only good examples from parents and family members. But the main thing for me was uh, a verse in the Bible that states, uh, He who began a good work in you will be faithful to complete it in you until the day of Jesus Christ. That's Philippians 1, 6. And I use that as my, my mantra that kept me through school, through all the struggles. And uh, um, I have seen God pull through even when I myself have doubted him. So that is the verse that re that's my favorite Bible verse. Man. So that is where I see God works his miracles through you know through me and um, I'm just grateful for that and I just want to tell all of us to continue holding on and don't give up continue reading your Bibles and study God is good the verse that has kept me along my journey home is Psalm 46 in verse 1 God is my refuge and strength a very present help in times of trouble and this scripture means a lot to me because I've been through a couple near-death experiences and I saw, I saw where God showed up for me in reality, not in theory, but in actuality. You know, God was there and his angels were encamping around me. So I always bear that scripture in mind because God really and truly has been my present help in times of trouble and I am alive today because God showed up in difficult times. This year has been a terrible year for all of us and we know how COVID has affected a lot of us, especially those of us who are Christians. For me, COVID has done some things or has set back a lot of things for me this year. But the one scripture that kept me alive was I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. So no matter how COVID has done anything for me, done set back anything for me, at least I know that God will be with me, that he will help me and make me overcome any challenge that comes on. My Christian experience has been a little bit different this year because of However, I have mentors inside of the church that has helped me on my path. Their names are Fred Robinson and Sister Sonia Lee. They taught me to embrace my challenges and always to lean on God. My scripture is Isaiah 43 verse 2 and it says, When you go through the waters, I will be with thee. And when you go through the rivers, it shall not overflow you. When you walk through the fire, it shall not kindle upon you. Or something to that effect. But the thing is, this has kept me, not just in COVID, because challenges always present itself. But one thing I remember, despite the challenges that I will go through, God will always be with me and always strong. What has kept me on this walk as a Christian is I have to give thanks for God and I have to give thanks to my family for helping me to have a closer, connected relationship with Him. With because through COVID-19, I've been faced with very, a lot of trials and tribulations, but God has taught me to have faith. And faith is something that all things to be and evidence of things not seen. So this COVID-19 has taught me that the Lord is my salvation, so whom shall I fear? So I have to give thanks to my family and for God.
Well, for me, it's the thought of always seeing them, always being able to interact with them, and what? <laughs> yeah. So it's the fact of always seeing them. Like I get like for me, I get excited when Sheldon takes in the group. Oh, we're having practice on X day, and we're going to sing on X day. For the group, we we'll always have a little get together. That's one playing Uno cards and food, especially. That's one. So mix and mingle and having fun with each other. Uh, I'm a music lover, to say that. I can't do anything without listening to music. And uh, what I do with the, play, with, the, with the music play on my phone, I build a Shaz playlist. So all the songs that we have sing or we haven't completed as yet, I have everything in, my, in a playlist. And each day, no matter where I'm at, even the bathroom bedding, washing plates, traveling to work. Yes, I listen to that playlist only, because it's only one playlist I have in my phone. So yes. So all of the songs them to me carry me through each and every day. And I look forward with singing with these lovely young ladies like practice time and otherwise from practice we have a lot of fun together so that's what keep our group vibrant so we chill together we do every we do most stuff together so chill together sing together go places together yes that's it for me what has kept me going is the bond that we all have for me is singing because I love to sing, even though sometimes I might not sound good, but yeah, singing has kept me going. And for me, I really appreciate the camaraderie among us. Um, we might have our problems one or two times, but that's fine. Everything that always happens in a group. I look forward to practices, even though it can take a toll on you, but it still is fun. It is honestly fun. We, every time we get together, it's not just for practicing. We might just want to spend the day, we go out and have fun, or we want sat some Saturday evenings, we stay at someone's house and just fellowship with one another and share our experiences throughout the week. We would most times have worship together also. And you know, worship also brings us together and allows us to understand each other to understand what the other person is facing throughout the week. It's not just about church and what happens at church, but worship is another place where you can tell a friend what struggles you faced in the further up in the week.